Hey everybody, it's Corey here, Salty Sergeant's Outdoor Adventures. Um, so, still prepping for our 4th of July pig roast, and we're going to construct a, a little, um, little TP style roaster thing. No, I don't really remember what you call it, but we're making the, the pit roast, or the spit roast. So, how we're doing it, I just took the chainsaw. And I notch these beams out here at this 45 degree angle. And we're gonna slap them together like so. Hopefully they fit. Now I'm going to screw this together, add our crossbar to keep it together, and then we're going to put loops underneath. So Notch the top of this pole. I'm gonna use the chainsaw again. So. cut towards my own leg that's a big no-no never do that but I forgot my angle and I had to make sure I hit it so don't do that though all right it's a little loose but it'll work I'll shim that so we're gonna go ahead and set it up
All right, it took me a minute, but I got my little thing framed in here. Got the fire prepped. So, here in a minute, I'll light it up. All right, now we got this pig up on here. Boom. We added some braces. I used two of these pine poles because it seemed like it was going to crack after I drilled holes through here and put these little metal bars through to hold it. And then this was a hog panel tie, those ties that hold them together when you put them on. So... My wife made a rub that she put on it with the um, Deer brand five spice. It has 10 spices in it, kind of funny. Now I'm just waiting on everybody to come out. We're gonna move it on over the fire. Yep, yep. Hey, hey. So my wife made a sauce to keep the skin pliable until it's until it's completely done. It's got lemon or lemon juice and whiskey and I don't know how much other crap she put in there. It smells like, almost smells like Seven Up. So face that. Not face it. Yeah, we're gonna keep brushing this on every couple of like 45 minutes or so. Cook this side till it starts dripping and then we'll flip it over and get the skin crispy when it's not done. Keep it up high and cook it nice and slow, then we'll drop it down right before it gets done. Crisp it up. Still cooking. It's starting to start to get brown and crispy and toasty. I drop my phone in the fire. All right, here we are. It's just about done. I'm getting all brown here. It is July 4th. This is our 4th of July hog. One side's a little browner than the other. As soon as the skin gets loose, we're going to do the tail check and then we'll probe it once the tail pops off. Booyah. Just about done here. Look at that, a little bit dark, but I've been cooking overnight. <laughs> 